hey guys hope you're all doing well welcome back to my channel thank you so much for always coming back to watch my videos in case you're new here welcome my name is d mwango a solo female traveler from kenya in africa traveling the world and so if you love travel videos this is the best channel to subscribe to so please subscribe as a way to support me and also so that you don't miss on any videos that i'll upload and hit that like button it's the best way to just appreciate my work and leave a comment let me know your thoughts feel free and let me know your thoughts in the comment section down below and also if you are a returning subscriber thank you so much you guys team d oh my gosh sometimes i lack words on how to express myself on how blessed i am to have you all team d you guys you are a movement i love you guys like you have no idea but really i mean it so thank you so much so guys from the title of the video <laughs> i know it has been a while since i uploaded um a video maybe some two days or you know but uh i don't know maybe i might uh, put it in here or not but let me see how it goes and i'll be editing the video so my last country in europe has been uh Warsaw, which is uh, Poland, and it was really a beautiful country. I had a good time there. You know, sometimes as a traveler, guys, sometimes I'm like, do you know what? I need to get it for myself. <laughs> I'm like, I just need to feel the moment. I need to like make the observations and all that. So if I happen to give you a glimpse of how it went down, then it's all fine. But if I don't, I just want to say thank you so much, guys, for standing with me always. You guys, you have been amazing. Like, I don't know what to say. So finally, what am I trying? What am I trying to mean? I'm saying our Europe tour is finally coming to an end. Oh my gosh. I have a lot to say. Maybe um I'll be taking you along bit by bit maybe when I do my live streams or anything or if you have questions but I really enjoyed traveling in Europe it has been a brain how can I say it has been like my mind changer like my game changer me as a person the exposure like everything has been amazing like I don't regret coming to Europe and thank you so much for the government for the embassy that gave me the visa to come to Europe this was such a beautiful experience like I learned so much some things even the camera can't even speak you know anyway guys I'll give you um a bit on how my travel experience was the countries that i liked more but oh my gosh you guys my guys finland was one of my best countries i can't wait the finnish people are just you know they're just too kind too sweet i'm like when i come back to europe next summer i'm like finland will be my first country <laughs> And also Netherlands, like those two countries, they have my heart like in a big, 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 big way. Anyway, guys, so it's that day. So these are my bags are ready. I know you guys could be like, what? D. So I'm going to say goodbye to this beautiful <laughs> suitcase that I've been using here in Europe. Because, you know, Europe, the broads are so good and all that. It was so easy for me to move around with this. But again, I just have to get back to this because of my next adventure. Because uh, it's going to be a wild adventure somehow. So I'm like, this will do good. So actually, it's more of uh, what I used to have previously but now a baby one you know like a small bag <laughs> it's really small so it's more of the big ba backpack that i had those who have been watching me for quite some time so here i've put all my clothes you know like an extra pair of shoe and all that and i've been calling this beautiful place home this is my view wow this is Netherlands, guys. I've been enjoying here. So without forgetting, I just want to give a special shout out to my host here in the Netherlands. She doesn't like being on camera, which I appreciate, but I know she want to watch this video and the entire family. Let me just take a moment to express my gratitude. They've been hosting me not once, not twice. Netherlands has been like my home, you know. Anytime I feel like I want to have a break, I've been coming here. I've been eating a lot of fruits, like good food, organic food. Those who follow me on Instagram, please go follow me on instagram d mwango official so that you don't miss on my on my uh, real life uh, stories like what is going on you know so i just want to say thank you so much thank you so much i really appreciate she's like a mother to me i really appreciate i know she want to be watching this thank you so much for having me all i say is may god bless you together with your family and everybody you know like you people came uh, through for me in a big way and i don't know but i just have a lot to say like team d you guys have been amazing 
amazing. My Europe tour was made possible by some of you guys, like Liz Budus. She's a part of Team D. She also has a YouTube channel. She lives in Italy. She hosted me in Italy. She hosted me in Poland again. And, uh, you know, Kish, my world. Uh, uh, Neklesha in Italy. And, uh, like, everybody who hosted me. Oh, my gosh, you guys, you've been really amazing. Hey, my beautiful girl. She's called Chinese Kiki in Belgium. Oh, my gosh, you guys. You really came through for me, like, in a big way. If I haven't mentioned your name, I'm so sorry. But also, I just want to say thank you for those who wrote to me. But because of time, it was impossible for me to meet you all. Like, in Finland, like, you people, like, in Estonia. Like, you people were really writing to me. But because I was moving so fast, I wasn't able to, like, uh, reach you all but i just want to express my gratitude and say thank you so much team you guys you are a movement oh my gosh you guys thank you so much everybody who showed support to me thank you so much i can't forget people like queen ball oh my gosh like how thank you so much for coming through for me like you people you've been amazing and also you guys some of you guys sent me donations for the drone oh my gosh like i don't know what to say you guys i don't know but i just feel like this video somehow i just want to dedicate some time just to to say thank you so much to all of you guys team d like you guys have been really really amazing aaron thank you so much for the big donation on the drone like so many people really came in through for me so thank you so much i really 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 appreciate the list is long if i might not mention your name don't be like okay so d doesn't appreciate the help that I, you know the support or, you know please just bear with me you know but anybody who came through me i really appreciate in a big 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 way thank you so much for your prayers thank you so much for always showing up premier gang you guys you're the best i really 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 appreciate you all so it's time for me to say goodbye guys i want to say goodbye this place i've been calling it home i've been working from here like it has been an amazing place really and i just want to say a big thank you to my host i had some light like this place has been really 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 amazing really which i really appreciate my view from the door from the window i mean this place has been amazing so special shout out to my host special shout out to everybody you guys team d all of you your prayers your advice your dms your i don't know where i should start from but guys thank you so much so from the title of the video finally i'm saying goodbye to europe guys i want to take you along and uh let's do this i want to go downstairs i want to take my breakfast so let's do this together guys and please hit that like button and also let me know your favorite country that you really liked in my entire europe tour in the comment section down below and tell me why okay so let's go downstairs guys today i'm so excited oh my gosh guys so yeah let's go downstairs okay guys back to <laughs> back to the other way my backpack me good to go but now it's not so heavy as the first one this time round i've really limited myself so i'm going to leave this other suitcase here because i'm still coming back soon 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 anyway guys so i'm outside this is where i've been calling home but i won't show you much so here is my breakfast you guys like this makes me feel like i'm in nyabohansi so these are grapes and uh, fresh from the tree as you all see like i've been eating lots of them they're like everywhere oh my gosh you guys look at that Way! fresh 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 grapes and i don't know if you know how expensive grapes are so i've been feeding on these grapes look 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 woo, 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 woo. look at that Aish, Aish. this is one of the reasons why i love netherlands and as i said i can't wait to be back like who this whole place was full of grapes i just finished them <laughs> so breakfast is ready look at that guys hey what a beautiful life so blessed and and lucky right all, everything all together so i want to pluck some for my breakfast just so quickly just like that food on my plate huh? <laughs> anyway guys let me pluck some of them because i just want to eat them before i leave just to say goodbye I'm supposed to have like scissors to pluck but 
let's see because this is not the best way to pluck them i know for sure ah there we go so i just plucked this one hmm? wow so green and fresh oh yeah oh thank you <laughs> And here is Mr. Johan. He has been of great help to your girl, guys. Thank you so much, Mr. Johan. I really appreciate driving me around everywhere, still helping me get the grapes. Okay. Thank you so much. God bless. Woo! Thank you! <laughs> this is more than enough, guys. So I want to eat this so quickly, then we go. <laughs> yeah, thank you. Wow, guys, you see? Why D loves the Netherlands? For me, this is the key to my heart. Such things. <laughs> I really appreciate it. So I just want to eat them so quickly. I want to wash it first. Mm. You guys, my guy. Huh? Nice. So guys, just a glimpse of where I've been calling home. My host, she's just amazing. She does uh, catering. And she loves antique stuff. As you all see, she has lots of kettles here. And they look so beautiful as decor. I've never seen so many uh, teapots. teapots. Yeah, teapots like this in my life, like in my life, like in a huge number like this in a house. I've got 3,500. You have 3,500? Yes, the boxes even. Wow. Look at this, also in the cupboard. Yeah, but they are so cute. Look at that. Ish, 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 ish. <laughs> there are more in here you know she really loves 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 wow 3500 in number yeah <laughs> that's big so that's cool. huge dutch auntie <laughs> uh, my dutch auntie you yes. guys Aish, but they look beautiful what do you guys think let me know so i've been eating my coffee your from brother, here your dutch brother <laughs> your big brother yeah yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah thank you so much so guys i've been eating properly here cookies and everything the kitchen really. hey look more more um now how do you call this vases yeah bottles <laughs> collecting, bottles yeah collecting ones. wow yeah we collect bottles yeah. guys, african beers here yeah, we have even a kenyan beer tasker <laughs> We have oh, I've Kenyan seen it. Beer. Yeah. And Mongozo, beer, yeah. Beer. Hmm. Look at the plant. My bananas, you guys. You see? When I say I was well fed, you see? Till I'm leaving more here. And coconut. <laughs> you guys, you all know the coconut is here. And she also has a beautiful kitchen because. That's where you're cooking, eh? Your food. <laughs> I've been cooking ugali here. Those of those of you who have been watching my Instagram stories, this is her beautiful kitchen. Wow. <laughs> You see the coconut that I've been talking about. She's such a, uh, a talented chef. She loves her work. That's why her kitchen is so huge and clean. Do you guys see the level of cleanliness? Like, look at the flow. Huh? I've been staying in a very exclusive, beautiful place. And once more, I want to say, Auntie Tandy, thank you so much. This place has been beautiful. Eish. <laughs> maybe someday when i have my own place i should have a big kitchen like this because where well, it has been amazing just cooking here and just look at how clean it is and she does this by herself cleaning everything cooking everything just name it this is just an inspiration ah yeah she's an african actually but she cooks for dutch people and very exclusive people like big you know like big government officials like presidents name them and she's well known here <laughs> guys you see she already packed my breakfast just the way congrats mom will give me chapatis and put them in a paper bag and be like go eat as you go <laughs> so thank you so much guys you're welcome thank you so we'll much you soon. thank you so much yeah, take care. thank you so much yeah. i appreciate it so much okay <gasps> guys look at that <laughs> hey thank you so much auntie tandy this means a lot you know she's more of a, a mother to me just like what my mom will do because of time guys we headed to the airport i can't believe it guys i'm saying goodbye again it me it feels like a dream it really feels like a dream you guys my guys and i know you guys didn't expect it but yeah it is what it is but the good thing is uh, i'm really ahead of time i'm like how many hours six hours early <laughs> because i don't want to rush i can't believe it finally i'm leaving the netherlands i'm leaving europe not only netherlands but europe you guys my guys 
So where do you think we are going? Hmm? Let me know in the comment box down below. I know you guys are eager, but oh my gosh, like Europe has been amazing. I met a lot of good people. A lot of good people have come through for me. Like, I don't know how to pay back, but I can say from the bottom of my heart, may God bless, you know. And most of those people who have been like coming through for me without expecting like anything in return. Because most people, when they help you out, then, you know, guys traveling alone, you have to film, you have to do everything. And still, you know, some people will be like, you know, they want to talk more to you, call you. And if you don't respond in time, they get mad. They're like, oh, now she's not talking to me. But guys, I wish you to please understand. I travel alone. I have to plan everything alone. I have to film. I have to edit. Like I have like so much. So sometimes if you feel like, oh, she haven't answered, just bear with me. Okay. So oh, I'm going to miss this beautiful neighborhood. I've been calling home. Wow. 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 Just like that. We are leaving Europe. I can't believe it. It's how, it feels like a dream. Huh? But wow. I'll be back. Inshallah. By God's grace. Oh, guys, I have a lot to say, but um, yeah, thank you so much for always being with me, for always being there for your girl. It means a lot, a lot, a, a lot, and special shout outs to everybody who came through for me in Europe. If I haven't mentioned your name, just know I'm grateful. And also you guys, just watching my videos, being there for me, you guys, you are a movement. Sometimes I see how you fight for me. You are like sometimes like I'm like wow what did I give you guys like to deserve all this love but I'm really really appreciative thank you so much like may God bless you all and uh, may we all be prosperous and wish me a safe journey guys it's gonna be a long flight of over 10 hours on air so all shall be well and I don't know guys <laughs> Where do you think we are going? Let me know in the comment box down below. But finally, my Europe tour has come to an end. I don't know, maybe I should just eat my breakfast as well. I tell you, when you have such mothers with you, life is just so sweet and good. Imagine, they even pack for you breakfast. Isn't that amazing? Oh, thank you so much, y'all. But now I need to do it quickly before the lights. <laughs> oh, yeah. Ah, there we go breakfast as I go to the airport huh? the healthiest breakfast ever fruits guys and that's the way to remain healthy and um, you know and strong because what I do like my lifestyle doesn't allow me to add weight and just you know so I eat fruits drink water coconut water and all that and walking a lot creating content helps me to to be physically fit i don't need to work out i just eat clean it's just it's more of discipline so good morning and cheers <laughs> mm. Mm. so good mm. wow the banana is one of my top top favorite fruits with coconut water my best best so guys, we are leaving, um, this area is in Delft, right, Johan? Uh, it's really near Delft, yes. Mm -hmm. uh, yeah. yeah, so we're leaving this beautiful place. Look at how they have beautiful roads, you guys. Look at the buildings, like, hey, Europe has just been an eye-opener eh, to my life, and I can't wait to be back. This is quite new, new uh, buildings, huh? Uh-huh. It's the latest thing. Mm -hmm. I don't know what they store into them, but it mm -hmm. must be a lot. I don't mm -hmm. know, I'm not, I'm not aware of it. Mm -hmm. Over there, there's this film with dogs, we call them dogs. And dogs. The big trailers just uh, hang on to one of these dogs. Mm -hmm. So they are on equal floor, mm -hmm. so you can drive in and out the, 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 the trailer mm -hmm. itself mm -hmm. with pallets and, uh, mm -hmm. and stuff. Wow. To get the trailer loaded. Mm -hmm. Wow. It's quite convenient. Mm -hmm. Wow, guys. Hmm. Today the weather seems to be good because now winter is approaching, Mr. Johan. It is. It is. <laughs> huh? It's time for the, the t shirts out and the, mm -hmm. and the warmer fleece jackets, etc. <laughs> yeah, a lot of jackets, you know? Yeah. Wow. Hey, but hey, Netherlands is beautiful, guys. Look at these neighborhoods, and equally very green. Hmm? Wow. This is 
is a store for uh, for for building inside your house. You oh, know, Bauhaus. Bauhaus, yes. Mm -hmm. Right there. Just one of uh, one of the, the, the quite a lot. You see, people love to uh, to rebuild the inside of their houses with, yeah. with wood and, mm -hmm. and laminate and so on. Mm -hmm. mm. <coughs> wow. They are right there, guys. Mm, wow. Tech easy. <laughs> yeah, thank easy. It's, it's, uh, well, you, we are we are a bit worried about fuel prices uh, uh -huh. right now uh -huh. because they are uh, really uh, on a level they were not before the war, mm -hmm. the Ukraine war. Mm -hmm. and, uh, That's why they say take it easy. <laughs> yeah, thank easy, take it easy. Mm -hmm. But uh, you know. Mm -hmm. Yes, it's like over two euros right mm -hmm. now. Yeah, but life has really gone high everywhere, you know. Not yeah. only here, also in my country. Every everywhere, the economy is wow. It's something else. Yeah. Every, the prices of everything changed, you yeah. know. Yeah. yeah. Mm. Wow! I just finished my first banana. On to my second banana. <laughs> I really love bananas, guys, so much. You know. This was just a nice idea for her to pack it for me like this. So we are headed to Schiphol. Yeah, this is the main airport in Holland. Mm -hmm. There are more and they're growing. Mm -hmm. Schiphol has become so big that you know they'd like to to delegate flights to other airports in the mm -hmm. area, mm -hmm. like. Uh, there's one over the border in Germany. There's two or three more in Holland. Mm -hmm. And it's it's a, still a growing business. Tourism has, has grown huge. Mm -hmm. I mean, there's millions of people a year traveling by Schiphol. Mm -hmm. <coughs> and, uh, it's a busy, big airport. It's yeah. quite a busy airport. Actually, one of the busiest airports we have in the whole world, you know, like it's extremely busy. Actually, I normally feel like it's one of the major and main airports in uh, in Europe, you know. I normally feel that, but let me know. So, if you take that route going up, you go to The Hague. Actually, I've really, really like ex explored Europe so much, even more than what I've been showing you guys. Like, I've been to The Hague, but I didn't make videos there. But in Dutch they pronounce it as Den Haag. <laughs> Mr. Owen is surprised on how I get it right now. <laughs> yeah, you're <done> perfect. So. <laughs> I did it perfect, guys. Den Haag. You know, you have to. Den Haag. Yeah, you know, the Dutch has the. <laughs> Like it's scheveningen. Yes, scheveningen. You know, like you have to, you know, it has to come out. That's the Dutch for me. I can't wait to be back. When I come back, I can't wait to learn the Dutch. You know, it's one of the most beautiful and interesting dialects that I really desire to speak. So I can't wait for that. Okay. Yeah. So we are hitting the road to the airport. Wow. To Schiphol. You know, Schiphol. <laughs> Yeah. Schip is uh, a ship, really. Mm -hmm. It's the same as ship in English. It's a schip. Uh -huh. in and the hollow mm -hmm. means the, the land is. Uh, it, the, the, all of the airport is cause it, it lies within a former lake. Mm -hmm. So it's really deep down mm -hmm. uh, below sea level. Yeah, actually, yeah. Mm -hmm. and all, of, all of this place near the coast is below sea level. Yeah. Okay, that's good. Telephone.
Wow, guys, uh, finally we are here at Skipol, and Mr. Johan wanna just uh, see me off because the airport is extremely huge. Huh? Guys, my new travel buddy. Hey, this is a baby bag of the other big one that I had, but <laughs> eh, the journey continues. Huh? Wow, this airport is really huge. Is it too heavy? No, it's not. It feels good. <laughs> yeah, but it's well made. The back is well well yeah. made so that at least you don't you don't hurt your back. Yeah. Hey, beautiful cars, you guys, my guys. Huh? Departure. Uh, we go here. Oh, okay. Hey, for sure, if it was just a taxi person who just dropped me, getting to gaze all these places, terminal. Mm -hmm. We're looking for the boarding gates, like uh, getting in. Wow, this is Kipol Airport, guys. Two, yeah. There we go. Uh -huh. Going up. Yeah. All right. Wow. The airport is really big. That's why it's good to be on time. <laughs> because you get lost here and then and traveling. Trust me, you keep. You know, you you get lost. Second like. floor. You know? Hmm. Rental car desk. Uh -huh. hmm, this airport is huge. Okay. Just so they are Skipple Travel International. Hmm. So, guys, this is how Skipple Airport looks like. It's really a huge and one of the most busiest airports you can ever come across in Europe. Oh, it's not moving. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. This one is not moving, but it's alright. Hmm, one of the biggest airports in Europe Schiphol. So this is how it looks like there are lots of um, You know people traveling in and out and it just reminds me the airports in uh, in Qatar, you know And also I think Dubai where you have to take trains to go to the boarding gates, you know, do we have trains in here? No, 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 okay Uh, no, this one is opposite. Yeah, we can follow this one. <laughs> Hopefully, it does. <laughs> it does it. No. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Wow, Skipper Airport. So huge. We have Sheraton right there. It's equally a big, you know, well known hotel. Sheraton. It's also in Kenya and many countries. Okay. Ah, so guys, I already stamped my passport. And oh my gosh, I came here three, not even three, four, five hours ahead. But this airport is extremely huge and the queues are so huge. Well, so I'm rushing to get E19. This is 18. 19 should be somewhere. I keep going straight head on. Hey, you guys, I'm so tired. Huh? 
here. Here. <laughs> it's a tricky situation. <laughs> Hopefully I don't miss my flight. Because yeah, the queue was extremely big, you know? In 19. 20. Where is 19? Oh, 19 is there. On that other side. Hey. Guys, be sure you leave in time. Skipo Airport is extremely huge and the queues are incredible. Okay, so that's my boarding gate. Ah, I was like, maybe I'll arrive on the flight. <laughs> we'll have gone, but I have like 30 minutes still. So yeah, we made it. Hilarious. So finally, it's time for me to board. And oh my gosh, I just want to say thank you so much, Europe, for being so good and beautiful to your girl. See you next time. Wow, saying goodbye is the hardest. But uh, yeah, we need to keep moving, guys. Thank you so much, my Europe uh, fans, supporters, everybody who made my Europe tour a beautiful. I just want to say thank you. I can't believe it. I feel like whoo. <laughs> it's real, 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 guys. Yeah. So now it's time to board. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. As you come through the gate, please have your own individual boarding pass and passport open at the photograph page ready for inspection. From all of us at TUI, have a great flight. Wow, finally. Time for another adventure. My, um, I don't know which continent, which number in terms of continent Africa, Asia, Europe then the next one on to my fourth continent i feel so blessed oh my gosh so i'm on the queue time to board i'm so pressed i can't wait to just go and release myself because i was crossing fingers because where are the queues but anyways i really love the fact that it's self check-in but for people who are not from the a European Union it's more of a manual you go stamp your passport but the rest from the European Union and uh, the rest you just go scan and it's self uh, uh, control but for us you need to go and uh, manually give the passport you let them stamp but they don't ask like unnecessary questions the way I find it when we are leaving Africa sorry to say but it's a struggle most when I'm leaving Kenya they have like so many details to check but here you give your passport and boom bye <laughs> you know it's as easy as that wow i love the words there i don't know if you can see artists do your thing yeah i'm one but in a different field artist doesn't mean singing also what i'm doing taking you along is being an artist okay guys the queue is moving well not long i can't believe it <laughs> goodbye europe see you again soon hmm? For real, for real, we're living. Huh? We're living in Europe. Hello. Okay. Hello. 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 Thank you. Hmm, finally. Oh my goodness, you guys, my guys. Oh, Jay. Okay, hello. Hello. Oh. oh right. First, I want to put my luggage just a second. Oh, okay. Um, oh, there's space there. Just a second. Thank you. So guys, this is gonna be my seat for today. Nee! Ja, 
Thank you so much. I appreciate it. Uh, yeah, I, I want to run to the wash washroom, then come and drink it. So yes. I think I'll put it. Do we, the, do we have a... That's what I'm looking for as well. I think maybe on the side. Or if you don't mind, you can just. It's oh, this. Oh, oh, yeah. I think this is it. Here, it's you on the side. It on it. Yeah, it's on the side. Hopefully, it doesn't fall. Yeah, sure. Yeah, there we go. Oh, I never saw this before. Oh, oh. oh I've seen this before. Yes? Yeah. Oh, like this? this is so beautiful. Yeah, like this. Oh, yeah. So I'm just gonna leave it. Yeah, I'm gonna leave it here for a second to go to the bathroom. Then I'm coming. Yeah. Thank you. Uh, I don't know where the washroom could be. Maybe the bathroom. Let me try and see. Yeah. So I'm looking for the bathroom apparently. Yes, of course, in front, yes, on the left hand side. Oh, thank you. Okay, guys, I was dying. You guys, my guys, I was dying. Oh. oh, so guys, finally I'm back, and uh, I can't believe I'm leaving Europe just like that. Like, uh, oh, I can't believe it. Actually, always saying goodbye is the hardest thing we travelers do, but still, at the end of the day, we need to keep moving. So I'm uh, traveling today with two airlines. It's my first time, but I feel like it's probably like kind of maybe the best in uh, Europe. But I remember when I was going to Luxembourg, it was also one of a kind. So we just got in and they served some. Uh, this is orange juice. If you so finally I'm leaving, man. I can't believe it. And thank God I have a window seat. <laughs> I didn't reserve it, but I think God is just with me. And also um, the pass the passport control when you're leaving is extremely seamless they ask nothing they just stamp and you're good to go so i can't wait to take you along and where do you guys think we are going let me know in the comment box down below oh my gosh what i'm so excited at the same time i feel bad i'm leaving new york but for sure i need to come back i need to come back so goodbye Europe, thank you so much for being good to me. I can't wait to be back again. Cheers guys. <laughs> My flight will be about 10 hours from Schiphol. That's uh, the capital uh, city of, actually not the capital, but the major airport in Netherlands. So, um, where well, I can't wait to be back, really. Oh, we also have some water here. Hmm, amazing. Okay guys, wish me a safe flight. I'm so excited about our next adventure. I can't wait to take you along guys. And uh, I really thank God for all his mercies. He has been with me. Like, hey, sh for me, I don't know. I'm highly favored. Like, where? I can't just forget to say thank you to God and you guys for wishing me all the best. And uh, on to our next adventure. This is going to be one of a kind, just like Europe. And let me know your favorite country in Europe. We visited how many countries? <laughs> I can't even remember. Maybe, th maybe 13 or 15 around there. I'm not so sure. You know, because I took a break all of a sudden for like two days then. Ah, then yeah, it is what it is. We are living now. Ah, the orange juice. Okay, guys, goodbye. <laughs> Europe, wow.
The pill will be off. We'll be taking off and oh my gosh, I'm getting emotional. I'm like, oh my gosh, like I really had one of my best time here in Netherlands and I'm leaving from the main, the, the same airport and it's hitting me so badly. I'm like, oh my gosh, I just want to thank everybody who has been with me all through. My auntie, Tandy, Johan, everybody. Oh my gosh, the lift is long and wow. Goodbye, Netherlands. I can't believe it. I feel like I want to cry, you guys. But I can't wait to be back. I love Europe. Europe is beautiful. Wow, guys. I can't believe it. Finally. Wow. Oh, my gosh. Guys, just like that, you're leaving Europe. Just like that, she's saying goodbye to Europe. Oof. Als de bemanning je vraagt het vliegtuig dringend te verlaten, laat dan al je handbagage achter. We zijn bijna klaar om op te stijgen. Controleer nu of je stoelrit gesloten is, de afgeleiding van je stoel rechtop staat, het luikje voor het raam open is of niet verduisterd en je tafeltje opgeklapt is. Meer informatie over de veiligheidsvoorschriften aan boord van dit vliegtuig vind je op de veiligheidskaart. Zit je bij een nooduitgang? Kijk dan op de veiligheidskaart hoe deze uitgang geopend wordt. Ja, ik ga niet even mijn Bedankt voor je aandacht. Doei, best je een magische vlucht. Dat is toch goed? Er zitten veertien in huis. Tegen de tijd dat we er zijn, denk ik, ik wil geen bruin op mijn foto's. Ja, ja. Ik wil geen foto's. Ik wil geen foto's. Ik wil Oh my gosh, I can't wait to be back. Honestly, I feel really emotional. Like, me coming to Europe was a blessing. Huh? And now, I'm leaving. Oh my gosh, you guys. Huh?
moving or recruiting softly and nicely. Uh, we've already been served with that mix. I already finished my orange juice again. So I just want to take a nap because, hey, I haven't been like sleeping for long hours. So I'm like, okay, so now I can have my long sleep. But, uh, hey, they're serving more food, more drinks. But I have my cashew nuts with me. I already drank some orange juice. I think I just need to rest. Oh, otherwise this is one of the best airlines the blankets are cozy for a moment i was like did i book a business or you know or something because hey, the treatment here is so cozy even the seats like everything is so different you see like the leg room is more than sufficient uh, there are curtains at the front see the front and the back we have some somewhere I'm like it really feels luxury I'm like did I <laughs> hey, did I advance today but I think two is one of the best airlines here in Europe so I want to take a nap then I'll see you later guys so guys later it's time to eat and wow look at the menu so they give you the menu and you decide what to eat so this was what this is what is making me feel like hey D, did we upgrade today because we're really traveling in style not the normal way you know you can have champagne you can have anything that you want you know we have the menu there but i don't understand so <laughs> more so here okay i'll just have to ask uh, the attendant to maybe translate to me so that i can know what i can choose huh Bon appetit! So guys, time for dinner. I'm having some rice, vegetarian rice, and some uh, chicken, some juice, orange juice, some bread, dessert, uh, some vegetable salad. Wow, looks so good. So this is basically dinner for tonight and i must say tui is one of the best airlines ever what do you guys think let me know so guys time for dinner i'm having some rice vegetarian rice and some uh, chicken some juice orange juice some bread dessert uh some vegetable salad wow looks so good so this is basically dinner for tonight and i must say tui is one of the best airlines ever what do you guys think let me know been here where is this Hapa ni wapi Hapa ni wapi the Swahili want to mean where is this Okay let's go stamp the passports Welcome to Mobe Ooh wow You guys my guys welcome to Montego Bay I can't believe it. Oh my gosh, you guys. <sighs> Wagwan, my people. <laughs> I can't believe it. His desire to ride the train was postponed when he migrated to Canada at a young age. Oh, some good history here. Huh? Oh, dream destination. Welcome to Jamaica. 
I can't believe I'm here. Yo, and the airport is so beautiful with a lot of stories. Look at that. <laughs> you guys, you all know your girl how loves the beach. Woo. Hey, my Jamaican fans, finally. <laughs> oh, look at this. Hey, beautiful villages of Jamaica. Hey, I can't wait to join. Wow. Lots of art. Hey. So guys, I just arrived in Mobe. Mobe is the second largest city in Jamaica after Kingston. So Montego Bay is one of the most visited islands. Wow. Enjoy the flavors of Jamaica. <laughs> I can't wait. This is one of the foods I have to try. The chicken jack. You guys, my guys. What? I can't wait. Huh? I can't believe I'm in Montego Bay. I'm in Jamaica. You guys, my guys, what a surprise. What a surprise. Did you guys expect I could be in Jamaica now? <laughs> wow, God. Oh my gosh. The joy inside me cannot be explained. Trust me. And you know, Jamaica is a visa free country for we Kenyans for 180 good days. Huh? Wow, beautiful arts. Hmm. It's amazing. Find your adventure. Okay, I'll stop filming from here now. So guys, I just picked my bag. Thank God it made it here. Big shout out to Tui Airlines. So let's go out. Oh my god, you guys, walk on! And I met one of Team D, she came to pick me at the airport. Walk on! <laughs> so her name is Barbara James, for those who normally like watch the premiere gang. So I have one of the premiere squad with me. <laughs> Thank you so much for picking me up from the You're airport. You're welcome. Like the love in Jamaica is something else. From the immigration, they ask nothing, but also, Jamaica is visa free for we Kenyans. So when you come in, you just uh, process your passport, you get a receipt, and that's all. There's nothing. You know, you no. just, the immigration is like, welcome to Jamaica. No just problem. Like that. Jamaica, no problem. Yeah, no problem. <laughs> <laughs> Finally, so I just Finally. got out, and uh, yeah, we are here at the taxi se uh, section. Yes. And uh, Barbara was like, D, where is the suitcase? I'm like, I changed the suitcase to this small travel buddy now. <laughs> And Jamaica is warm, but again, this is it because I love the warm weather. So it means now it's bikini, beaches, and oh my gosh, <laughs> I can't wait. When you're gonna hug the person, okay. how is the person doing? Say, uh -huh. walk one. Uh -huh. yeah. <laughs> I can't wait to learn the Swato accent. That's all I want. Okay, guys, walk well on. <laughs> A little later. See you later. <laughs> yeah. Come out here, you know. Uh -huh. And no, uh, they're fixing the airport and I didn't yeah, know what it is. Hey. <laughs> I don't know just how you know. The station over there. Uh -huh. Yes, and they move it. Wow. Yeah, they, they move the gas station as well. Oh, yes. Okay. See, I was there wondering what happened to the Nothing so happened. I'm here. Wow, good. Wow, good. Johnny, I can't wait for tomorrow. Yeah, I wanted to come to this. 
I'm so excited. Yeah, it's a picture that you have to come. Yeah, I want to record it with my yeah. Montego Bay! Yes, 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 yes. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you so much. I appreciate it. Hey, now I want to learn the, 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 the accent. Yeah, don't <laughs> okay, let me go into the Jamaica deep house and catch it. Oh my gosh, you guys, my guys, this is a dream come true. So a big shout out to Barbara James and Anne for picking me up at the airport. They brought me to this beautiful place. They bought me dinner. Oh my gosh, the love, the support. Oh my gosh, they got me this beautiful place. Oh my gosh, you guys, my guys. Aish, my Jamaican fans, wagwan! I'm now here. Oh my gosh, I'm so blessed. I don't know what to say, you guys, my guys. Thank you so much, Barbara James, and you guys are amazing. May God bless you all. So let me give you a quick room tour of my home here in Jamaica. This is where I'll be calling home for a couple of days. It's in Mobe, or rather Montego Bay, but they call it Mobe. So let me just show you what actually this place is. Uh, 10,000 Jamaican dollars per night. That's almost $64 a night. Okay, so I only paid for one night. I think so. I only paid like uh, for one night. I only paid 10,000 and I'll be here for three days. So Anne and Barbara paid two nights for me that I just paid a single night. Isn't that beautiful? Thank you so much, Anne. I really appreciate from the bottom of my heart. So welcome to my beautiful space. So from the bed, oh no, from, not from the bed, but from the door area, this is how it looks. It's a beautiful area. I'll show you around tomorrow how the outside looks like. And of course, I'm watching my brother here. His name is Aya Mara. Go check him out. We're going to get to 400K subscribers. This is home. He makes me miss home. His name on YouTube is Aya Mara. Road to 400K subscribers. So I just put my shoes there. Then uh, I have a working table here. And uh, yeah, I have some cups here for coffee, water, um, kettle. And uh, on this other side, I have the bed. It's a beautiful big bed. I really appreciate it. And remember, it's 10,000 Jamaican dollars a night. It's around 64 US dollars, I think so. So for a night, okay? Welcome to Jamaica. Then uh, I have a couch here. And uh, I love the deco. Looks beautiful, really nice. The room is beautiful. Here's just... Um, a storage area i just put my bag here and also there's an ironing um, thing here to use while ironing and uh, on this side we have the bathroom it's so cute oh my gosh look at that the towels huh? it's so clean and sealed you know cleaned you know so i haven't used it yet clean towels then uh, this is where i'm gonna take shower from they provide everything the soap you know this is the sink and of course the mirror <laughs> yeah outfit of the day this was the outfit of the day while i was traveling 
So we have uh, the sink here, very clean, of course, with hot water and uh, cold water. But Jamaica is hot. So I'm going to take cold shower, definitely. Then there's a bin there. Then uh, that's it, my guys. So this is where I'll be calling home for a couple of uh, days. And I have the AC there. And this is how the roof looks like. Beautiful. Wooden. Wow, I like it. So this is where I'll be calling home for now. So guys, I officially welcome you to Jamaica. <laughs> I love Jamaica and finally I'm here. It's a surprise. I know you guys could be expecting D to be in Poland, Warsaw, for those who follow me on Instagram. But now your girl is in Jamaica. Surprise! <laughs> Wow, I'm so happy. So please be sure to subscribe, hit that like button, leave a comment. Let me know what you think about today's video, but I'm really excited, full of life. And oh, this is a dream come true. Wow, God, my people. Like, I just want to learn the part to a language, you know, like the Jamaican English accent. You know, it's different. They speak English, but the accent is really, really different. So I really want to live, get into the culture. And oh my gosh, I just can't wait to take you along. So please be sure to to subscribe for more videos hit that like button and don't forget to leave a comment and share the video to your friends and relatives let's hit 400k subscribers okay we are so close let's do this guys so i just want to end this video right now i just want to take shower and edit it for you guys so i know you're all excited if you're from jamaica let me know if you'd wish to meet me up write me on instagram d Mwango official it's in the description that's the easiest way to reach me out and uh, yeah we're gonna meet if time allows and also i wanna say team d thank you so much you guys you mean the whole world to me and now welcome to jamaica so we want to start with the uh, more bay which is montego bay this is where i first landed then we want to explore other cities we want to go to kingston we go, we're gonna go to ocho rios we're gonna go to you know so many places so stay tuned and let's enjoy jamaica <laughs> and let me know what you'd love to see from jamaica because your wish is my command i love you guys see you on tomorrow's video Video, premier gang you mean the whole world to me and i wanna say bye bye guys